Well, hello there, everybody. Welcome back to more Alan Wake. Uh, yeah. So last night was was really good. I I was blown away by uh, how good Alan Wake was actually, um, and I'm very excited to keep it going. You know. Uh, so, you know. Let's let's uh let's get her done, huh? Uh, last time, oh shit! Last time we uh, ended on chapter, end of chapter two, beginning of chapter one, um, and or beginning of chapter three. <laughs> uh, we just met Alan Wake, and he is worse for wear. So let's see what happens now. Let's see what happens next. I am really enjoying the game so far. It's like really top notch. Apart from like the issues I had earlier when I first started with the audio, uh, which got resolved by putting it on the SSD. Um, solid game, solid. it saved there all right I don't know why it didn't save I to, excuse Andy, me the chapter started where did you go all of a sudden the radio stopped working and then that flooding just disappeared you crazy forest is this who I think it is oh shit Casey say hello to Alan Wake you can see him Mr. Wake this is special agent Alex Casey wasn't expecting that. He'll escort that. you to our car. Casey, I'll meet you there, right after I take a look around. If the flooding's receded, there might be evidence we missed earlier. Okay. See you there. I'm Alex, Casey? Pain. How? Am I still... Is this the dark place? I don't no, think so. Be. I got out. I'm thinking... Yes, the P.I. from your books has the same name as me. Oh. Great. Moving on. That's funny. Okay, um, so... Bit of a hike to the car, Wake. Oh, my God. Get your bearings, then we'll head Stop. out. I just... I, I need another minute. Cauldron Lake. I thought yeah. I'd never see this place again. Cauldron Maybe Ocean. Not. But you should know these woods aren't the safest. Yeah. Uh, it's getting dark. You have a flashlight? It's getting dark. It's not safe without a light. 
It was dark. I have a light. Right, and I a guess gun. I'm exploring. You relax, Blake. And pages. If you see pages of writing anywhere, you must take them and keep them safe. Our lives could depend on it. I have been. They have vital information. If you know about the pages, Blake, we'll keep an eye out for them. Okay. Okay, just give me a moment. Mm -hmm. It's okay. I missed you, Alan. Okay, I'm gonna explore. Should look around. Yeah. With the flooding gone, could be further clues out there. The so flooding disappeared very suddenly. I wonder if there's any connection to the overlap to Nightingale. Yes, there is. Uh, at the end of Alan Wake 1, he said that it's not a lake, it's an ocean. And the fact that it's an ocean might imply, like, you know, there's a lot of water and a lot of, like, coming out of the water into, through the overlap, the mirrors, you know, reflections. Um, a lot of, uh, overlap <laughs> between them. Um, oh. Hello, Alexa. Thanks for the follow. How are you doing? Just chilling, playing playing Alan Wake. Um, I got to chapter three last night. This is the start of chapter three. Um, Remedies made some of my favorite games, <clears throat> and this one's no exception. It's very good. Now I was talking about the. Uh, Reflections and mirrors and water, all that fun stuff. The duality of the self. And I wonder what this game. Oh, cool. Um, I wonder how this game is going to handle that, explain, and explore that. Oh. Hello. Go away. Nope. Oh, Alright. Are you going away? Oh shit. <laughs> oh you did, thank you. This is not how the story goes. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm so glad I can circumvent the story. I need to look at the case board. Oh shit. That's what I need to do? Okay, I guess I can do that. Um, recently I've been playing horror games because, you know, October, but I think I started with horror games uh, in the summer. Um, mostly just going to be playing games that I have not beat, that I own on Steam and wherever, um, that need to be finished. Um, as well, it's kind of like a way to, to, uh, finish the backlog. But for now, horror games. I keep pressing tab when I mean to press escape. The controls in this are a little bit weird. Nightingale goes missing for 13 years, shows up murdered, and then turns into a monster. After I stop Nightingale, a rider who's also been missing for 13 years turns up. Kind of strange. What's the connection? What kind of case is this? That's true. Um, and also... I prefer one like them because they kind of get rid of like that existential dread <laughs> um, and depression like a lot of the time I get depressed and I just I don't feel anything um, and then horror games will come up in there and like get the adrenaline flowing and just shock you and sometimes make you like last night I was I was so happy that I was playing this game you know, it was it was a very good experience. I thoroughly enjoyed it. All right, let's let's get that wolf before he gets him. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, I wish I could turn that off. Don't make me waste my ammo, bud. No, you're there. Even the animals are turning into monsters. Yeah, it's kind of weird, actually. I have six in. 
Is he done? Is he good? Is he gone? This wasn't here before. Another man. I'm not going to read that yet. Oh, hey. Because I'm not safe. And uh, this game told me that going into the mine palace when it's not safe isn't a good idea. <laughs> so I'm not going to do that. I might go to the witch's cabin first and do that. I see they brought back the yellow paint from the first game. What are your favorite games, Alexa? Inside cell. That it over there? Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, I heard that. Coming back? Mr. Wolf? I don't think I killed it. God, this game is so pretty. And the first one kind of was too, um, but it, it definitely shows its age. There's something written here. There's also a camera a poem? here. Or a riddle. Reminds one. me of the nursery rhymes I read to Logan when she was little. Uh, one bird for light, two for darkness, three birds for a fight, four for a struggle, five birds for injury, six for misery, seven for the ending, whatever it may be. What does it mean? A little clothespin doll. Perfect mm -hmm. weird souvenir for Logan. <laughs> I'm I'm very much wondering if Logan is actually alive or not. I'm I'm a little little worried. So there's a camera here and we can't use it. Do anything with this? Go. Oh, okay, so one bird for light. So there. There it is. Oh. oh Something that was feels cool. different. I should look around. Hmm. That's Charm. interesting. Ooh, Cute. That is cool. It'll look great on the bracelet Logan made for me. Huh. Next. That's good. That was that. strange. Gotta keep an eye out for more of these rhymes. Agreed. Wonder if I can take this. I definitely hear animal. Oh, they're just people footsteps. Okay. Hi guys. I didn't realize I got both of them with that. I'm a little rusty. Apologize. Oh man, the stuff I've been seeing about Alan Wake Online is really cool, and I'm I'm excited to keep going. Oh, I should do this again. Okay. Come on, little bird, give me your Charm. prize. Thank you. Cute. It'll go great on the bracelet Logan made for me. Now that I know what's huh. awaiting me. That was strange. Gotta Actually, keep an I'm eye out for more back. of these rhymes. Wait. There's also a sound somewhere. Oh, I think that's just the enemies, actually. Never mind. Maybe? Okay. I'm gonna keep going. Kinda weird that they just huh. I guess the attacks are random. Got safe movements. Yeah, I got gotcha. you. I should heal <laughs> now that I'm here. Actually, uh, should, maybe no. I've got nothing for that. Whip. Let's do that. Okay. 
Back into the darkness we go. Uh, Witchfinder Station. I don't think I've been there before. There's another stash, yeah. Definitely have not been this way. Another fucking lock. Okay. I guess I gotta find that key. Uh, from Alaska to British Columbia, Washington, Oregon, and all the way down to California, the Pacific Northwest area spans over a diverse range. Here we'll find 59 threatened or endangered species of plants and animals, including the mighty orca and wild gray wolves. Oh, the Pacific Northwest region's ecosystems are wonderfully diverse. They include mountain areas like the Cascades and Olympic ranges, as well as the dense forests around them. In the west, there are several islands and dry desert plateaus cover the east. Some of the common wildlife calling the Pacific Northwest their home are robins and seagulls, squirrels and otters, cougars and deer, coyotes and raccoons, salmon and blue herons. The marshes and ponds of this area host an impressive variety of fauna, but majestic trees like the black cottonwood, big leaf maple, and Oregon ash thrive in the other wetlands too. It truly is a nature lover's paradise. That sounds nice. I would like to visit at some point in my life, actually. I like cool nature, like dense nature like this. Very pretty. Well, here's the station. I also don't know what time it is in game, because I feel like it was already nighttime. <laughs> but I guess night is coming, which is not necessarily a good thing. It looks like there might be a stash around here too. It's got one of those like colored rocks. I feel like that's an indicator of a hidden stash somewhere. But keep an eye out for those hidden rocks. Oh, another manuscript page? No. Okay. Tip of the day: When nature calls on a hike, check the direction of the wind before answering. <laughs> uh, hi. How are you? How you doing? How's it going? That, that's a good tip, actually. <laughs> Observations. Hikers have broken off branches of some of the trees down by the lake to make an illegal fire. Tried to fix some of the damage, douse the area, maybe put up more instructional signs. I also found some tracks I couldn't recognize. Pretty big. A wolverine or footprints that were smeared. Uh, either way, they were wandering around in strange patterns. Might be a sick animal. We'll need to keep an eye out. How are you doing? Poem of the day, the sun as she sleeps knows not the woes of men who toss and turn and worry and fret and wish they had her blissful slumber. Observations, picked up a bunch of trash left by tourists despite posted guidance. Humans are the worst. Uh, thought of the day, every majestic pine was once just a wee acorn. It's a good thought. Observations. A lot of new growth in the area. Some of the saplings I planted earlier are really thriving. Must be all this rain. I don't mind it either. It's great sounds to sleep to. It's amazing what a good night's rest and a warm cup of tea can do. Acute bronchitis sounds disgusting. And it also sounds like you keep getting sick. <laughs> so I'm so sorry. Because um, that, that's awful. Thankfully, I haven't been sick too much like the, the the times that i get sick it's mostly just like emotional causing physical symptoms so like um psychosomatic stuff which sucks but it's not nearly as bad oh Rest easy, buddy. i guess i can pet all the all the deer <laughs> It's really dark, but it's there. Okay. Mm. Keep hearing sounds and wonder. Is there anything in this cabin of importance? I feel like I should be able to open that bag and find stuff, but. Those damn kids always getting people sick. That sucks. You feel any? You just feeling a little better? 
Objective, research into the reality altering effects discovered in the Cauldron Lake area, utilizing fiction and art as a source, and then manifesting the results into existence. The FPCs, oh yeah, oh my god, yeah, the FPC. I forgot that uh, Federal Bureau of Control is mentioned in this game, which is from their other game, Control. Very cool. A month? Jesus Christ, that's awful. I had something like that, but it was it's just a weird cough getting used to all the like the new um plants here when I first moved. Uh, methodology. The FPC's intent in this research project is to experiment with nursery rhymes, here and after referred to as fiction, in an attempt to recreate the conditions under which the writing would become reality. The hypothesis is that there are two ways in which fiction affects reality, either by reflecting events that have come to pass but that are not known, uh, not known to their later creator, whose act of creation therefore becomes a catalyst for these past events, after which they serve as a source of their own inspiration, or by the fiction itself being the initiating force in its present timeline, using the creator as a conduit. In this experiment, we will create nursery rhyme text with specific function, uh, and then use the depicted dolls and symbols as needed by a careful testing process with the purpose of the story told in the fiction manifesting itself in real life. A variety of combinations involving the dolls, symbols, and rhymes will be tested in order to collect large amounts of data with the hopes that a pattern will appear. Methods will be adjusted in the testing years. So they're, they're pretty much saying um, that Alan Wake has powers uh, using that fiction and the Federal Bureau of Control is interested in investigating his his uh, ability to create using his writing. So that's cool. I like the way that the two games are being blended together in that way. What's this? Uh, two, one, one. Uh, oh, more clues. Okay. A hero doll. A wolf doll. Anything else? I think I just destroyed something. Where's the fiction? I don't see it. Anything? Maybe it's not in this room? Because there's nothing else to this, right? Okay. Arrangements. Hmm. Gotta find a place to put the dolls. I didn't really see anywhere, so I don't know. So I don't know. Uh, password. Cool. Oh wait. Does it say two five four seven? Can I try that? I don't think it's it. No, that's a much larger password. Oh, that was it. Okay. Uh, I have received your favorable review of my project proposal. Thank you. I need not remind you that my academic as well as recreational expertise in mythology, folklore, and writing uh, will indeed lend the needed credibility to the project in both leading it and creating the testing material. Dr. Eugene Campbell. Department of Parafictional Research. Interesting. Uh, here's a promised update on the project's first experimentations. The test items were plastic animal figurines, teddy bears, toy cars, baby dolls, the icono icono iconographic nature of the test items was hypothesized to be beneficial for those research purposes. Test results negative. I'll continue testing with more advanced items and scenarios. No response from you is necessary. Project Nursery Rhymes. So I see con the Department of Control was uh, hard at work in uh, Bright Falls. I guess there's nothing else in here. Okay. Um, I think this is the safest place as any to check out. So, anything good? Video, why does it keep telling me that's new? Okay. Back at Witch's Ladle, Saga pointed the flashlight at the strange dark substance. 
The same substance Nightingale had left at the morgue. There was something hidden under it. She strained to see the opposite of sunspots in her eyes, blacker than black. Suddenly a change. The light reacted to the substance, a feedback loop surging up her arm. Saga squeezed the flashlight, willing it to penetrate the dark matter, burn it away. At Witch's Ladle. Uh, have to go there. An overlap with the dark place needed a push from both directions to manifest itself. Reality in our world eroded by repeated dark lore tied to a location, and a counterpoint, a work of art, a horror narrative crafted in the depths of the dark place, connecting to the story on the other side to reach out through the weakened veil. A story of a lawman whose heart was cut out of his chest, two corrupt men killed by their own twisted ambition, a haunted old woman drowned in the bathtub, twisted reflections on the other side of the mirror, arcs stabbing through realities, amplifying the influence of the dark place. These elements working in conjunction made a trickle that became a torrent, a wormhole, a vortex, and the art, the map, became the nightmare territory where the dark place encroached on our reality, a blanket over it, where they overlapped, causing reality to twist and loop like a bad dream, remolding anything and anyone within its dark horror design. Hmm, interesting. So I guess there's like, there's two writers at work, I suppose. Creepy dolls, mysterious rhymes. No weirder than anything else going on, I guess. I got so many clues. Um. So Bright Falls rhymes. <clears throat> nope. Okay. There's so many clues. Cauldron. Oh, because I'm at Cauldron Lake, right? Keep trying. Strange dolls. Um, probably on the Who. Yeah. Wolf doll. <sighs> I don't know what that doll is for. Reenacting the rhyme made the environment change. Interesting. Strange dolls. Nah. Is it here? No. Oh, that's the rhyme puzzle. I didn't see another puzzle. Rhyme found near the bridge of Cauldron Lake. No strange new rhyme. Some of these don't make sense where they go. Nope. Guess here? Yeah, okay. And then... Yep. Nope. Does that not go here? Aldrin Lake, I guess. And then... Eugene Campbell. The FBC is definitely playing with things they don't fully understand. It's true. And that always goes well. Uh, I'm sure it does. We'll see. I wonder how Control 2 is going to tie into the whole Alan Wake franchise stuff. That'd be cool. Can I turn the light on? No. Okay. I'm going to do one more sweep of this place in case I miss, like, a rhyme that I can solve. I didn't see anywhere to put dolls, so I don't think I did. I think I hear a TV. Unless that's just me. I think that's just the swishing of my jacket, actually. It kind of sounded like a, an old TV changing channels, though. Anywhere to put dolls. Oh, there might be a rhyme outside, actually. Station. Arrangements. Oh, this is telling me how many... How many there are. There's two at the station. Which... I don't know. I don't, I don't see one inside. 
already read that. Okay. Oh, oh, oh that's just the door. Okay, I don't think there's anything in here. Time to go outside and see if there's any puzzles or rhymes. Or puzzle rhymes. Ruzzles. Another one of those rhymes. Of course. <laughs> The hero, brave and strong, left home to right a wrong. From the woods came the wolf, so greedy and hungry, that he ate what he found in the house without a host. The hero returned to find she'd lost the thing she loved most. Left home to right a wrong. From the woods came the wolf, so greedy and hungry, that he ate what he found in the house. Um, say the wolf goes here. The wolf returned home. Oh. No. <laughs> when you get it wrong, you get it wrong. Um, the hero, brave and strong, left home to right a wrong. Maybe? Uh, from the woods came the wolf, so greedy and hungry that he ate what he found in the house without a host. Doesn't make sense. Okay. Hero left home. Not quite sure. That doesn't Keep make sense trying. either. Yeah. What did the hero love the most? That the wolf would eat candy? The hero is a kid, I would imagine. But I still think wolf goes here. But I don't know where the hero goes. Nope. Hmm. Right or wrong. Unless hero goes here. Because he left home. And then uh. wolf. Oh, that that was it? I really? Have a weird feeling something's changed. I can't believe that was it. But Oh, I didn't follow the wolf tracks last time. What is this? Okay then. I didn't know that was a thing. So now this is showing okay, I'm gonna get a shotgun just in case. That the wolf came to the house without the hero. <gasps> oh, hello. Oh shit. Another charm for my bracelet. Another charm. So the puzzles are gonna give me charms. Oh, it saves me from death, but shatters. Uh, I'm gonna save that in a place where I am dying a lot. How about that? So they said there's two arrangements. Here. I'll look around the Witchfinder station. Let's see. There's another thingamabob. I don't think I saw anything before. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else here. Uh, how's my map looking? So that's as far this way as I can go. There's something stream side, so I go down and take a left. Reach the car, Anderson. How's it going down there? I think I'm done here. I'll meet you at the parking lot. Du, du, du. Put up a parking lot. No. Where is... Gotta keep going. This way. That's locked. Right? Is that the one I was looking at? No, wait, this is the one I have the key for. No? Uh, maybe not. Okay. It looks like a stash, and it's by stream side. I have to, like, I have to, uh, check it out to the cult stash at the stream oh at the stream okay let's 
so it's south. Supposedly, there is a stash here. Aha. I think I see it. Uh, minus two. Wait, why? What was the point of that? It says an arrow. Oh, plus two, minus two, plus two. Something. Oh, hi. Fuck you. Oh, you're fast. Oh, fuck off. I dodged you. Bitch. Gotcha. That sound is so annoying. Thank you, Epic, for creating one of the most annoying ways to find out you have achie box. achievements. Is that the cult of the tree symbol on it? Plus three. I don't know what the math means. Rock, rock, tree. Are you bright enough? Rock, rock, tree. Oh, okay. Rock, rock, tree. Rock, plus three. Three plus three. Rock. So, rock is three plus three. I forgot what symbols were on the lock, but. Okay, so. Three plus three. Seven minus two. Oh, so six. Uh, five, eight. Six, five, eight. Or five, six, eight. Six, five, eight. Or five, six, eight. Five, eight. Or five, six, eight. I am bright enough. I'm I'm not one of you. Ooh, that gives you an upgrade to capacity. I like that. Uh, throwable gas canister. Just oh shit. Okay. Interesting. A lot of different types of supplies in this game. Interesting. I still didn't find what that stash key was used for, though. Oops. Interesting. Because it said by the stream. Unless there's something this way. Oh, hi. I see you, asshole. Looks like a stash there. Maybe that's what the key's for. Oh, no, it's just open. Okay. Oh. I'm gonna take a guess. Nope. Okay. Oh, it's just telling me that there's, there's like another lunchbox. 
Yeah, a lunchbox. I looked down at the rippling water. The moonlight danced over each and every little wave, a marching band of shimmering light. Lonely and cold, I hugged myself inside. I thought of him. Then the surface of the lake calmed, and like a spectral surprise, he was there, his face smiling at me, reflected in the water. I looked up, not daring to believe it was true, but it was my, it was true. He was there, my love, my savior, <coughs> my writer. Nine. Oh, that's good. Is that supposed to be Alan? Alan's wife talking about him? Her love? Her savior? Her writer? I would imagine so, but I don't know who's leaving those lunchboxes around. Those kids' lunchboxes. Um, did I go to the witch's hut? I don't know how far it is. Break room, which is a point of interest. Or, uh, not sure. Container, container. Um, if I take a left, what are these circle? Oh, the murder site. Okay. So I'll take a left up the hill and just keep going back through the murder site. I don't know what, what's down at the witch's hut. Anything in here? No, okay. The general store. Can I heal a little bit? No, okay. And then... I don't know what the red means. But I'll take a right. And then I'll go up the hill to the car. Oh, it's blocked off. Okay. So I can't take a right? It's hard to go around. God dang it. The lights are blinking. I'm thinking it's all. <laughs> Fucking hear you. I'm gonna check the map again just to be doubly sure of where I'm going. So, go to straight and take a right. There's gonna be two paths. Or left. There's gonna be two paths to the right. Okay. Straight. Two paths to the right, take a left. There's one path. I hear you. I don't want none, unless you got some. Hi, friend. That's the murder site, so I'm going the right way. I can't. Oh yeah. Nope. Oh. That doesn't sound good. Let's go see what that's about. What's the Federal Bureau of Control doing to this poor forest? I was so fucking excited when I came down this way last night and then someone was uh Warning. Here. Activity detected. A W E. <gasps> A W E's. Event in progress. Cauldron Lake. Oh shit. What's an A W E? Um, Casey. Active weight. What exactly event? does the FBC do? After New York, when I started.
started looking for our friend here. Their name came up. I pushed them for any files they had on him, but got stonewalled. They have a reputation of showing up for weird shit. Yeah. They have a presence here, and now we find our writer. It's like the X-Files. I think an AWE is an active wake event, but I don't remember what the acronym stands for. Hmm. So something's happening in Cauldron Lake currently. I'm glad we're leaving. I think control was like in like a different dimension that the federal department federal bureau of control all right man let's, yeah let's get the fuck out of here dude go back to bright falls we go to sleep mr wake we're taking you back to our field office in bright falls you can freshen up there and then we'll talk roughly Hey, Mom, before you say anything, I'm totally fine. Don't freak out. Dad shouldn't have even texted you. Logan? No one texted me. Hmm. What's going on? I'm totally fine. I slipped. That's all. God, it's not the end of the world. Put your father on the phone. Um, okay. Dad, it's Mom. Don't worry, hon. Oh, okay. Logan slipped in the shower and bumped her head. She has a slight concussion, but I'm keeping an eye on her. <laughs> Lucky I heard her fall. She could have drowned. Jesus, David. Why didn't you call? I tried. It didn't go through. She's mm. fine, really. But what about you? you oh, no. I'm stressed. No. Is Logan going to drown? Just a weird case, that's all. Well, if you need a hint, my years of board game victories tell me Colonel Mustard did it. You're funny. Love you, Dave. Love you too, honey. Wanna say bye to Logan? Just tell her I love her. Bye for now. Elderword Palace Lodge. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's what the fucking uh, TikTok was. Okay. I believe her partner, Alex Casey, is actually Sam Lake, the writer of the game. I think. Is there anyone you'd like us to reach out to, Mr. Wake? You've been gone a long time. No. No. They mean no. danger. Oh. It'll come for me. Okay, let's talk about something else. Robert Nightingale. Do you know him? You were both here in 2010. Oh, yeah. The Dark Presence got him back then. That's the last time I saw him. 13 years. Oh, fuck me. Tell us about the pages. Gladly. You have what looks like a title page with you. Return. Is this the name of the story on these pages? The writer's name has been scratched out pretty violently, but your name can still be made out underneath. <laughs> scratched out. Yeah, scratch. Hmm. What does that mean? Did you write these pages, Mr. Wake? I'm trying to remember it. It's, it's a crazy jumble like a... Like a nightmare. It doesn't. It doesn't make sense. What was he doing for thirteen years? Plays Alan.
so well count. I remember Mr. Brewer. Oh, this is the ending of the first game, I think. with no memory of how it got there. Huh. It was out of control. I didn't need another mugshot in the fucking tabloids. Had I already oh, done the show? Was that a recording? Matt Allen, Mr. Door. Uh, those are the two guys, or the um, people that wanted to listen to Coconut on repeat. In the first game, I yeah, felt a strange pull the toward the TV. <laughs> I love how much they learned from control. So cool. <laughs> oh man, it is so good to see you, Alan. That, that this must be an exciting time for you. So tell me, does it ever get old? Sorry, does what get old? Publishing a new book. <laughs> Are you okay there, my friend? You look like you've been cooped up in the writer's room for a few too many years. Thirteen years. Exactly how I feel. <laughs> you know. I've waited so long to get my hands on the sequel to The Archer. You left us on quite the cliffhanger. We've all been dying to know what... It's not a lake. It's a <laughs> lake. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Both. Well, our Same. Is over. Your new book, Initiation, hits the shelves tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> it's so that fucking exactly meta. what every reader will be asking. This book is mind-bending. It's so cerebral. I mean, how would you describe it? A, an auto fictional thought experiment, a, a, a horror story, a postmodern detective story. Wait, this isn't right. I, I haven't written anything. He's so humble. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you got me. Good friend, very funny. But yeah, I just have to say, I, I, I've not written this. I'd remember if I'd written a book, right? Or maybe it was written by your evil double. Oh shit. <laughs> well played, man. That is spot on. Playing a role here. Pretending the world of the book overlaps our own. That's very meta indeed. You see, Initiation tells the story of a fictional writer named Alan Wake, who is trapped in a nightmare, desperately trying to find the manuscript of a novel he has forgotten he has written. The book <laughs> is set in New York, but it might not be New York at all. He is tormented by his dark doppelganger guided by visions of a fictional detective he has written that's right mm. alex casey is in this book as well alex casey i guess we'll just keep doing this the whole show the joke's on me <laughs> isn't that what you sign up for with auto fiction no but seriously i found the the structure of the reality you build in the book fascinating it reminded me of the matrix I mean, the writer is physically in his writer's room, trapped there, and he projects himself out to this dark dream of New York through the story he is writing. Hmm. Uh, like astral projection. Did I get that right? Yeah, that's exactly right. Go on. I should be taking notes here. <laughs> notes to that other Alan Wake in that room writing this as we speak? Yes. Are we all in the story, Alan? Oh, God. <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> no, I, I, I wish you every success with your new book, Alan. I hope it's as successful as your best-selling Alex Casey series. Initiation hits the shelves tomorrow. 
After this, I'm sure we'll all be eagerly awaiting the culmination of this hero's journey. To oh, shit. Universe. Alex, Alan Wake 3 confirmed? Or sure. confirmed? <laughs> Man, thank you for one of the strangest interviews of my entire career, Alan. All this talk of nanomorphs. You have to expect him to disappear once he's seen yours. Oh, you're gonna. Boom. <laughs> Bye. God, it's so weird. I fucking love the meta narrative. Hello? I'm losing it. Something's not right here. I needed to get home to Alice. Alice, that was his wife. What the hell was that interview? Some kind of joke? Initiation? I never wrote a book called Initiation. This felt like a bad dream. You know Could make of. a good horror story. <laughs> the meta. <laughs> The meta horror. <laughs> it's so good. That'd be too easy, right? Yeah. In between with Mr. Door. Oh. I was a mess. I had never heard of this talk show or Mr. Door before. None of it felt right. Was I losing my mind? You could say that. My interpretation of many worlds. Oh, Casper Darling. Hi, bud. I miss you. Wait, wait, wait. Casper Darling. I think he's from Control. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. I, f I fucking love this. It's so good. Casper Darling. He was a scientist that was doing the experiments in, in the Control um, uh, universe. Hey! What I think I've been locked in. Anybody? Fuck. Now I have to find the code myself. Great. Yeah. It's not gonna be there. Where would the if I were a code, where would I be hiding? Old gods of Asgard. Old gods of Asgard. That name sounded familiar. Um. Oh. Six is. <laughs> 665, neighbor of the beast. <laughs> nice. Hey, that's the passcode. of a memory surfaced about riding here for countless days and yeah, seven days as a matter of fact there's a TV initiation a plot boards were mapping out a story on the index cards the nightmare that just happened to me a summary of the story so far hmm. but other notes as well warnings I had written them I couldn't remember what it all meant. The name Scratch filled me with dread. Oh, that's just his name. I okay. could trust these words. I had to act on them. You must write to escape. Hmm. I see we got we got the uh, old suit back.
Read me. Beware Scratch, Alice. Part 1. Late Night. Waking up to a nightmare. At the talk show, I had thought I was home in New York, but none of it felt had felt right. I was trapped in the dark place, a nightmare beyond our world. The writer's room was my safe haven. My writing affected what was outside. I had to write more. I was writing, I'm trying to write a story to escape this place. The story was called Initiation. With the story I wrote, I projected myself out to look for a way to escape. I had tried many times, failed. This place made me forget. Everything Dor had told me felt true. Everything Dor had said had felt true. What was that part of my writing or coming from somewhere else? The dark place, trapped. You must write to escape. So, I assume this door is locked? Yeah. And I have to actually go back and write. It was big. I had to keep writing. Alright, so let's write. Alan Wake leaves room, finds Alice, goes home safely. The end. Sam Lake. I knew it. It's so fucking meta. Sam Lake, the writer of the video game, self-inserted as Alex Casey, who is Alan Wake's fictional detective, um, and also a quote real detective in the story of the missing of the fucking stuff at Bright Falls. It's it's so much to keep <laughs> keep track of. Um, also, the the theory is that Alan Wake in those thirteen years he was gone wrote the entirety of Control, the video game. I don't. We'll, we'll see like if anything of that comes comes up welcome back to the show so alex, oh hey sam's there as the uh, creator of the character how do you feel about this sorry what well, i know it can be an awkward question to the man sitting right next to you but i mean how do you feel about him in the <laughs> role of casey does he look the part to you Looks exactly like I always imagined Casey to be. It's uncanny. <laughs> Thank you. That means so much to me. I'm a huge fan of your books. So, uh, what's the problem, Alan? Because on more than one occasion, you voiced your reservations <laughs> about the adaptations. Uh, it's not that. They're their own thing. They've gone with choices that are different from mine. I. I I feel protective about my stories and these mm. adaptations. I, I, I don't know. I, I guess I just wish I could have been more involved in making them. Well, that's fair. In that case, you won't have seen this either. We have a clip from the new film, Murder Case Case. That's an Should awful name. Or do you want to say something first, Sam? Nah, just roll it. Sun, but there was only the night. Oh, 
So cool. I was tired. Insomnia covered me like a plastic film. I was watching the world through a rain slick window. My own reflection haunted the view. <laughs> I was trying to track down a missing writer. My only clue was a table lamp shaped like an angel. The only thing huh. to shed light on this sordid mystery. That's probably going to be important. Shape of an angel, and you're the missing writer, friend. All right. Oh, I can hear that monster breathing in the background. Okay. So one of these rooms, I imagine, has to be a lamp shaped like an angel. Is it the same book? Yeah, it is. Okay. Regular lamp. And is this closed this time? Nope. Okay. Oh. It's different, but it's the same number. It's just slightly different. Oh! Five six six? No. It's five six. Okay. Wait. What am I missing? It was not the same number. Six six five. Five six. Five. Oh. That's what it is. Five six five. Right? Oh, nope. that that was pretty cool. I like that. shape of an angel. go to the red light in case I'm wrong but I may just have to because I don't I don't see anything else that's different I'll just go and see what happens I haven't seen anything else that's different Oh, it's just open this time. Okay. Hello? <gasps> no, they didn't. They didn't. Oh. I can't believe it. I cannot fucking believe it. If that's who I think it is, I'm going to be so excited. And it it is. <laughs> oh man. Remedy, I love you. This is the janitor. From Alan Wake, or from Control. Not so much evil that not a bit of good as oh. well. Not one without the other. <laughs> good to see you. Hi, Ati. I missed you. Hey, I, I can't seem to find my way out of here. Can you point me to the exit? <laughs> of course, Tom. The girl will instruct its maker. I was gonna get something from the basement for you, but you can get it yourself now. Uh, the more cooks, the worse the soup. 
<laughs> Have we met before? Are you trapped in a dark place too? You remember Arcti? No. The janitor. Oh, you yes. can't be lost if you don't worry about where you are headed. So don't worry, Tom. The sun will shine even into a heap of twigs. Hmm. Just remember to turn on the lights. Always. It won't take long when you get to work. What do you want me to get from the basement? And my name's Alan, not Tom. Yeah, yeah, but the cut up for a man's a man, but the man with the tool makes two, Tom. <laughs> no. And a man with a tool can build his own exit. It's in a shoebox in the basement where you left it. <laughs> Safe as in the Lord's purse. Here's the key. Thanks, RT. But yes, who the fuck is Tom? I've been trying to find a way to escape the dark place. Any suggestions? He who mouths about his troubles is the prisoner of his troubles. Good advice. It's not easy to get out. But don't you worry, Tom. The home is still there where the heart is. I often think about it when I mop the floor and look into the puddle. Water is the memory of the world. Water finds its way. The janitor was a bit out there, but still a friendly face. I had to trust the basement would get me out of here. I'm so happy you're here, Ati. Which means the whole <laughs> combining control and Alan Wake is definitely like a possibility and we might see another friendly face too which would be fucking incredible if she's in this game hmm. again pants bricked Let's go check the basement. Hopefully, whatever this item is, it's good. Left in a shoebox. What? Oh, the light? That, that, that indicators? Stay in the light, Alan, as much as you can. An old lamp and a shoebox. Uh, Was this what the janitor had left for me? What is it? <gasps> oh, the, the angel. The lamp felt significant. A tool for bringing light to the darkness. Hmm. I felt a magnetic pull between the lamp and the light overhead. Oh. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna be fucking Dumbledore. Whoa! When the light jumped into my lap, the whole room changed. Like something in a dream. Opening oh. a way forward. The lamp was humming. The bulb glowed. It held the light now. This is cool. I felt another surge from the lamp. I can the glow in the lamp went out, Oops. shifting the light in the room. That's so the cool. The light carved out something new from the darkness. Very cool mechanic. Is the door open? Um, what happens if I grab that? The door is different. Okay. Okay, I'll check that in a second. Is there a way, another way up? Yes. And oh, 
Oh, there's a lot. Good shit. Oh. Uh, I don't know what the way forward is. I'm. I don't know which is gonna be progress. I'm gonna check this out first. I don't think this will be progress, but we'll see. back down in case there's something I missed in that room. I doubt... Oh. No, this way is blocked. What was the point of that? Why would I need to do that? I'd rather keep the light, though. Maybe it's in case I missed it. No, there's no way I would have missed it. The dark oh, place wants shit. to drown me. I'm losing myself. I have to fight it. I have to remember the clicker, the light switch. I lost it, but I have the lamp now. The lamp the switch was cut from. Hmm. This place is a nightmare. Not real, and yet more real than anything. The danger and the horror are real. It feeds off my mind. Twisting whatever it takes into psychotic reality. I'm trapped here. I write to escape. I've tried this many times. Written countless stories. Forgotten how many. I keep failing. But I must keep trying. I use the story to dive deeper. Every word I write is a step forward on the spiral of the darkness. I dive to the bottom to find the answer, the, the map, the key, the compass. It's combined to form a door leading out. That must be so I weird. I open a door, the sunny door, at the bottom of an ocean, that's not an ocean, and a lake. That's not a lake. Helen. <laughs> End of End of part. I didn't explore that area, but it's okay. What, what does that mean? End of part. Oh. Weird. Manual save. Turn to the heart. Initiation one. Late night. So what if? Oops. Shoebox and store your items. How would I need to store items? Oh. Weird. I guess I can keep going this way. Let's see what's upstairs this time. I needed to find another way out. Oh, is this why I can do this? Leave the light here. Mm, no. Where am I gonna grab that again? It's gotta be in the other place then. Jojo, Jotaro, Jutro. Oh, okay. I don't know how I missed this, but oh, where am I? New York. Shitty part of New York. The phone was ringing. Somehow, I knew the call was for me. Yeah, I don't see anybody else here. Hello? Hello, Wake. 
Yes. Do you know who I am? No. Who is this? <laughs> we'll get to that later. There are spies all over. Shadows. A sense of deja vu washed over me. Had I had this conversation before? Alan, listen to me carefully. Caldera Street Station. The subway. You need to go there. I'll call you again later. Make sure to pick up. Do I know you? I, I know you from somewhere. You've just forgotten again. We're in it together. Mm. Don't worry. I got it now. We've been working. Great. I I'm losing you. They've been Hello? Working. Hello? I wonder if Barry is still around. That would be interesting. Time is very confusing in the wake verse. Casey, initiation two. What the man had said Caldera Street Station. I had to go there. Weird. This is. Very wide open. Yes, I will follow lights. And avoid that shit. As best as I can. I don't like that the lights are yellow. There's no way out. Don't write return. Uh, uh, wait. Oh shit! Return is the third, the third book. It's telling me not to write it. Uh, why? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I don't. Illumination. Okay. Oh, Casey. Right. You lost her. Run? Run, rabbit. Run, rabbit. Return. Let's return scratch. Cult of the word? Is this the way it was on the page? What the hell? Oh, hey. We met at Door Show. Alan Wake. The writer. I'm Alex Casey, looking into a murder. Come on, what? What is this? There's a piece of evidence, a manuscript of a novel. You wouldn't know anything about it? A manuscript? What manuscript? I need to see it. Rumor had it the manuscript contained the details of the murders. Mm. A murder cult was following the story to commit their gruesome acts. Was Wake their leader? Had he written it? How far would he go to create a perfect work of art? Or would he be the next victim? Continue into the dark. Return scratch. Then there's the whole the controlled the pyramids. 
wonder how the pyramids factor into all this. I remember dying in this alley in a dream I had. He was just gonna keep killing me. Blue by blue. That is, that is cool. You're not gonna get what you want. You think you know. You know shit. You don't really wanna know. You're gonna get what's coming to you. Can't kill you. Alex? Hmm. Ah. Yay, flashlight and gun. Revolver. This was an echo of the books I had written for years. Picking up Casey's gun felt like I was assuming the role of the detective. Yes, you are. I'll oh, grab that light. Though. I have a light now. I could use it to make my way deeper. Hot. Shit. With the alley in darkness now, the rest of the shadows block my way. First off, I want to grab this. Saw those yellow arrows pointing me in this direction. That way. Wait, is, is this the same? Is this a loop? It was telling me to go that way. For a stash. Um, unless... I won't... I'm just gonna... I don't know. I think I see a light. something um. oh that's something there was something oh. hidden here light would reveal it words. Words. the words resonated with meeting had I written this words of power Oh, okay. Words of fix. <sighs> Increasing maximum health, sir. Increase maximum health. So I have one word to fix. Increase maximum health. Increase maximum health. Uh, uh, sure. Why not? Map. Light switch. to find the subway station. Where to, Casey? Lamp will emerge. Okay. Find a light for the lamp. Oh, 
Oh, so I'd have, do I have to write? No. No, I don't. Okay. Uh, alley is still dark, so I assume I have to light it up somehow. Take me in a loop. Power. Oh, I didn't mean to. That way. I guess it's just telling me about that. Okay. I'll see what happens if I go this way. Seems like such a waste of flashlight energy. The Caldera Street station sign was there, but the entrance was missing. I had to make it appear. Maybe I could use the lamp to reveal the station entrance. Yeah, that's the idea. So we're in Alex Casey's world right now. See what's over there, but I kind of don't. I'm going to check it. It might be a mistake, but that's okay. Oh, come on. Where does this go? Hmm. Is this another thingy? Don't write. Hmm. I don't know about that one, Chief. Writing is kind of like my superpower. Something like this way, maybe. Hopefully. We shall see. Night Springs. Oh, there's people. I don't know where this is going. This is... It's a safe place. Okay. Safety. I will take safety. We'll save safely. Uh, Alice. What about Alice? This way. Maybe another word of power. Oh. 
so many places to go. Lost. Quick. Oh, that was a waste. I don't know if there was actually enemies there or not. Where the fuck am I going? of like open worldy. It's weird. I didn't expect Alan Wake 2 to be more open than one. Kinda wild. Scratch can go fuck himself. For all I care. I'm not sure where I need to go now. I don't want to do that. Maybe I will. Is this door? Oh, okay. Now I'm back. Where I need to go. Whoa, 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 whoa. None of that. I will take a light, though. Fuck me. Oh. Run, 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 Get the fuck out of here. There's so many of them. I don't know if they're real or not. Street I needed to find another light to go deeper inside. Another light? I mean, I know where there's another light. Okay, I have to go back out. So it was going to make me explore anyway. I'm glad I explored before. The only issue now is I got to make it back out. Grab this light. Oh no. Go away. Nope. No, you're not. Go away. I don't like some. The word. So there's Cult of the Word and Cult of the Wood? Or forest or whatever it was. Gates to the platform were closed. I had a ticket. Oh. Give me them items, son. Oh. Do I go here? Yeah. Subway pass. Helps us run better service. You've seen. Something about the station platform felt significant. It would work in my writing, but I needed more. Something lingered here. A half-forgotten memory. An echo. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. That's great. I like that. Why an echo the person is just like you? Something was here. A vision of the FBI agent had come here before me on the trail of a murder cult. Gotcha. He'd gone missing. Presumed dead. The cult was leaving me clues to follow, connecting the dots from one murder to the next, inviting me to draw an obscene picture on the city map. Caldera Street Station. The name made me think of the exit wound of a bullet. I had a flash of inspiration. The ghost of my fictional detective. 
A story thread I could use in my writing. You discovered your first plot element. Ooh. Okay. I had a location. I had a story thread. I would put them together, write them into my story to create a path deeper into the dark place. Making progress. The dark place reacted to my story. The way into the tunnels was no longer blocked. Hmm. But there's blood. The Fed had glimpsed into the maw of darkness. It swallowed him whole. That's weird. What is that? The tracks led into the tunnel. That was my way forward. In a horror story, the victim keeps asking why, but there can be no explanation, and there shouldn't be one. I like that. I actually really like that. Oh, more of those lost. The blood trail continued deeper into darkness. What about me? Nope. Initiation. That's book two. Save here. Oh. Hi. Oh. I don't like the sound of that. Don't die here. I don't like the sound of that. It is a safe room, though. I'll do a quick little save here. And then... Shoebox. Is there anything in here? No. Okay. Alright, so it looks like there's multiple paths. Uh, oh, was that a cop car? I see Wee Woos. Lost. Find Alice. Don't write. Okay, so they don't want me to write, but they want me to find Alice. Where is Alice? I imagine she must have been looking for Wake uh, during his disappearance. Right? The tunnels were a maze. The blood trail led me on. Hmm. You'd think she would have given up at some point, right? Then again, Alan didn't give up on her, so... Oh. That way. Maybe she didn't? I don't know. Okay, there's nothing this way. Darkness. Uh, what am I supposed to do with... Oh, this way, that way, that way. Okay. I read the arrows wrong somehow. Telling me. Wait. Oh. What? Can I go through here? Can't see shit. But then that arrow was telling us pointing backwards. I don't know. Oh well. There's gonna be another arrow somewhere, maybe. Um, I need a light. There's a light. Another Oops. place to use in this story. I needed to search the tunnels for further visions, inspiration for the story that would lead me deeper. Hmm. I found a new scene. Rewrite reality I a new here. New scene to use. A new setting. <laughs> oh. This would move the story forward. Oh. There wasn't another path. Okay. I changed the story. And with that, the dark place changed. Hmm. The bad luck to be on this case. The cold can get you anywhere with that black magic. 
desert shit. Like the day shift handling. What happened, anyway? Some fed came looking for the cult, but it was a trap. A satanic mm. blood sacrifice. Anyone who gets involved with the cult, they're next. That's not good. I heard their leader is this famous writer, Alan Wake. They're unholy motherfucking messiah. <laughs> Sounds like a load of bull. Missing FBI agent. Okay. Oh wait, I can just. Oh, so I can control it. Okay. Just go back and forth. I see. I didn't realize I could do that. Wait, that might have changed something back here. Hold on. Uh, oh no, because I need a light for there. Right. My bad. Grab that light in a second. I'm gonna do some exploring first. Uh, one item. I'll take it. Okay. We're good. Another echo lingered here. Nope. A source of inspiration. I can't go back now, though. We got some words of power, though. I'll take it. Place of power. The word is your research can help me, ma'am. What do you know? There's more than one urban legend about the cult of the word. The murder cult used these tunnels for their ritual sacrifices. They say the cult reenacted the murders in Alan Wake's crime books. Wake was even involved somehow under a false identity. Mr. Scratch, huh. which is Mr. Course, Scratch for the devil himself. It was disturbing finding myself in the story this way, but I was desperate. And it felt right for the story. Oh, yeah. The plot element I found would drive the story forward. Murder cult. Oh. Change your Alan Wake. I don't know why I want to turn it on. Wait, what is this scene? tunnel oh okay so I can change stuff there can't change stuff here but I have two plot points that I can use um, I'll go back to the tunnel okay I understand now Imagine this 
murder cult performing their macabre acts beyond the collapsed tunnel. The cultists laid the Casey novel onto the altar with reverence. Hmm. Their twisted Bible. Casey novel. Hmm. And those are the manuscript pages, I believe. Okay, so I was supposed to make a loop there. God, this shit is. This shit can be really confusing. <laughs> the light there. And I still didn't find that. That. Unless that's just a word of words of power. Uh, I don't need it. You die here, bitch. The water was gone. The way forward was open. I didn't change anything out here, did I? No. What? What? No. Okay. Word. Anything in here? Yes. The batteries? I think so. Someone was humming. Was it worth the risk to go see who? Yeah. Hello. Oh. Hey, Alan. <gasps> you snuck up on me. The sheriff. Sheriff Breaker. What are you doing here, man? Sorry. Have we met? Memory problems again, huh? Yeah, we've met. <laughs> Tim Breaker. We've shared notes. Hey, I've made some progress on the map if you want to take a look. I do. Still haven't found my mystery man, though. You're making a map? Trying to. It's hard to map a dream, though. <laughs> I keep ending yeah. up in unexpected places. I find interesting things like those strange markings that react to the light. But never the one thing I'm looking for. Mm. Feel free to check the map out. Oh, I've been stockpiling supplies while I poke around. If you find a stash, take anything you need. I appreciate the help. <laughs> Who's this mystery man? Oh, it wouldn't be much of a mystery if I knew. <laughs> All I have is a name. Hmm? Orland Door. The talk show host? Oh, Door. No. No, that doesn't sound like him. The guy has many disguises, but a talk show host? No. I'll keep looking. Yeah, I kind of wish I played Quantum Break now. I want to know more about what Sean Ashmore's character has to do with things in the greater scheme of things. Orland Door. <laughs> well, that's my crazy wall. I'm just trying to make sense of things. Don't judge me. Crazy oh, shit. Any day. I was at the morgue. I was about to give the evidence to the FBI. Door transported me here to this dream reality. Why? Motive. Missing time. It's on how I always ended up here. Will I forget when I get out? Okay, so it wasn't quantum break then. UFO polyhedra. Oh, wait. Abducted aliens door UFO. That I think that's control. Dreams. The redheaded. <gasps> the redheaded woman. Yes. Okay. She might make an appearance. Oh, that'd be so cool. Actually. That'd be so dope. Can I talk to you more? No? Okay, I'm gonna... See what else is here. Thing. All right, man. Thanks, Tim. I'll be on my way. See you, Tim. Mommy boy. Like. What about me? What about me? Oh, hi. Hello. Hola. Como estas? Gotcha. So some of them turn into things I can shoot, and some of them don't. It's weird. I wonder if those are the stockpiles that he's talking about. Okay. I think I'm going to stop here. Um, I don't know how the... I believe that's the end of the chapter. Um, maybe. Or not a chapter, but a part, I guess. 
yeah, I'm gonna stop here. Um, I'm an initiation tool. I don't know how much longer initiation is gonna be, but yeah, I think two hours is a pretty solid stream session. Um, thanks for coming in. Thanks for following everybody. Thanks for checking out my Twitter. And if you're on YouTube, thanks for watching there. Um, I, mm, I'm going to watch the FNAF movie tonight. So we'll see how that goes. Um, I might stream tomorrow. I'll continue Alan Wake. Um, maybe I'll do it at 1 o'clock again. We'll see. Uh, yeah, thanks for coming in. And have a great day. Bye.